Alright guys, we're out here at Midwest Motorsports Complex, formerly known as Jackson Speedway. I'm out here with Charlie from the Daily Motor. We're going to drive this BRZ around a little bit. We've got some mud, we've got some dirt. Uh, we're testing out the brand new Falcon Wild Peak AT Trail tires on the BRZ, 205 60 R16s on the Braid Full Race A wheels. And uh, yeah, we're going to get this thing nice and dirty. I'm so happy with these tires. I think I'm just going to run them year round. We'll see how they do in the snow. But we've got about seven inches of ground clearance. Cool. And uh, you can see I've already been having a little bit of fun with this thing on some dirt roads. Really impressed initially with the mud performance. I don't know if we'll be able to tackle all the mud out here today. It's kind of <laughs> deep. The Bronco Heritage got a little bit dirty just a minute ago. Uh, but it got through in two-wheel drive. But I think we'll still be uh, challenged in the BRZ. We'll take this out a little bit later. Let's start in the BRZ. We'll do a little scouting lap and see what this thing can do. Every time I get into one of your personal cars, there's something new about it. So it's I, I know. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this is kind of the BRZ in its final form. The vision, the original vision has been kind of realized now and we're ready. So there's a few different sections to this Midwest Motorsports Complex. We've got this kind of tarmac, I guess it's about autocross speed track. It's yeah. got some nice flowing corners. It was used for karting primarily. And yeah. It, it does make for like a, a good track. single car wide autocross style time trial, time attack feel. Cool. Really gets you good at practicing lines and apexes because milliseconds count drifting <laughs> or it's just good for drifting practice this will give you guys a pretty good idea of how these tires perform in the dry a little bit dusty out here you seem to have a decent amount of front end bite still it yeah doesn't seem like you're pushing too hard yeah this handles well still these all-terrains were kind of the perfect balance of extra sidewall stiffness over a winter tire. But they grip surprisingly well on the pavement and in the wet, they're just awesome. Plus being able to shake that rear end loose in the dry is a little more fun. It is fun, yeah. It's like they're on camera. Give them a good slide there. Really good place to bring a car and shake it down. If you're gonna autocross the next weekend or something, come out here and pay the entry fee and just go lap after lap, feel things out, feel where your limits are. Yeah, so what are they doing here? Is it kind of just kind of the show up and run what you brung? And Yeah, the idea is, is a motorsports community, whether it's tarmac, dirt, a little bit of both, come out here and uh, you know be, be social, be friendly, be safe have some fun with this sort of thing and, and uh, be accessible. Cool. Look at this little muddy, do some rallying. It rides pretty well out here. It rides awesome. The <laughs> This is, the stock suspension is so soft. It's cool. <laughs> We've also got an oval track. Actually, we'll check that out here in a sec. Let's see if we can make it through this mud. Yeah, just power through. Yeah. It's pretty soft right there. Yep. Now that we finally got a little bit more ground clearance in the BRZ, it's so light, it just kind of tiptoes over yeah. everything. Yeah. So there's a dirt oval in the middle. The outside is paved. I guess paved is kind of a rough term today, but they're, they're working there's, on cleaning this off. There's concrete underwear yeah. under there somewhere. <laughs> it's all about lowering the limit. Exactly. You can reach it at lower speeds. <laughs> this thing sounds so good with the fuse unplugged for the active sound. Oh yeah. It's just a proper little motor. <laughs> oh, I wish Brower were out here. 
That's why I love this car. <laughs> that was good. <laughs> You're gonna clean the track off for him. Yeah, we're just doing him, doing him a service. We don't need much else. <laughs> See if it'll do it in third. Enter with a little clutch kick here. Some of that dirt out, get a perfect entry. Yep. Well, I'd be curious to have you hit the inside section too. And, yeah, let's uh, check it out. Yeah. A little bit tighter in here. Nice little banked corner here. Got some rougher ruts. <laughs> No scraping though. No Maybe issues. Still, still clearing. That's the beauty of ground clearance. Wow. I mean, this is such a great little rally car. Look at this thing. I know. It's just hustling. We'll do one more drift here. Transition into uh, dirt again. It is. Okay. I suppose you probably wouldn't have been able to do what you just did with the open diff. We'll take this section through here. A little bit slower. A little bit Follow muddier. Through. I think we can get through it. Oh yeah, easy. <laughs> through here uh, might might skip this section yeah it's tough to say I mean I yeah, think with just the right line you'd be good but you wouldn't want to if I brought my recovery tracks I know the Bronco will get through it because worst case scenario you just switch into four-wheel drive but I think if I brought my recovery tracks I would I'd tackle it but recovery tracks yeah I have these little um, you just set them down on the ground and you put your put your tires mm. on on them, and you just roll okay. through them, okay. and it'll get you out of a lot of different situations. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I've actually never needed them because I haven't gotten stuck since I bought them. Because that's right. how it works, Murphy's She's law. Yep, yep. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I think you could with the right line. Maybe once you experiment with some of the other mud around here, you'll get an idea of what what you can pull through. Yeah, exactly. But like this. I don't know, it's doing pretty well. It really is. This is a good test for these all terrains. The other thing is, you know, it's not very deep because it's just hard That's ground true. underneath. So You're worst right. case, you dig down to some harder, uh, harder soil and you you pull through. It's not yeah. like a big mud pit. You're right. You're right. Now, if we weren't the only ones out here, you'd want to be staying in a single direction for this track. That's right. But yeah, this is not representative of the actual <laughs> uh, course. We're we are the only ones out. We're there, skipping right, a so. bit. Yeah. It's a work in progress. And then we've got this middle section here, which is a little bit muddy also, but... Yeah. Um, we'll have to get a, a course made up. Yeah, we can kind of figure out something to string together through here. Yeah, we'll just check it out a little. Yeah, why not? A little, a little more rocky. you got to be okay with that. you got the mud flaps at least. Yeah. I like these high speed sections on the dirt. This is a lot of fun. You are probably the only person that I'd be okay with running at the same <laughs> <with this car. laughs> well, How was this try, through here? Yeah, was try, this okay? Try it. I, I, 
you'll want a little momentum, but it's it's straight, so I think you can make it there. It's more if you think the ground clearance. Is oh yeah, this is fine, easy. Yeah, those are uh, motocross jumps. Yep. I mean, this is a BRZ that we're just <laughs> taking through all this stuff, and it loves it. Yeah. It just doesn't care. No, it's so cool. It's we need so the WRX. Fun. I know. These tires, like this, is the most fun tire that I've had on the car now. That's cool. And you drove out here 40 miles down the highway, no problem. I got um, 31 miles to the gallon. <laughs> that's cool. <laughs> you know? So that's left-hander here. And then hard right into those cones there. Okay. And this is pretty cleared out, so once you get comfortable, you should be able to kind of drift to this whole section. Yeah. So hard left. Oh, nice. Okay, cool. Yeah. Oh, that's great. Your tails out the rear view window. <laughs> it's gonna be. <laughs> it's gonna so be good cool. footage. <laughs> Everyone should have a BRZ. It's true. <laughs> stunt driving school today. Yeah. Yeah. He's going to be able to drive just like you. <laughs> he will. <laughs> and then we'll have to find our way. I'll just back in here. Yeah. Keone and I uh, have matching Subarus. We do. <laughs> World Rally Blue on white with white wheels. Proper spec. Yeah. And just watch my extremities here. Cool. <laughs> <laughs> That's great. Uh, you can have a lot of fun with a rear-wheel drive car, manual transmission, handbrake, and a limited slip diff. Mm -hmm. Yep. That's all you need. This is the formula. <laughs> Let's see what uh, what temps we got up to out there. Woo! Yeah, we're sitting pretty cool. Not even that dirty. Hey man. Hey. Got, let's, get, let's get going over there. What's going on under there? Just, yeah, get some weight reduction. All right, all right. A little aerodynamics yeah. package. Hey man, good to see you. Good to see you as well. Man. Yeah. You guys remember Keone from the Rally Cross video? Hey, hey, hi. We're back at it, getting dirty. We got the blues on the sideways. Yes, we do. Matching Subaru. Yeah. 
<laughs> That's fun. That's a lot of fun. It's awesome, isn't it? Yeah. It is awesome. <laughs> the playground. The cool part is, it's all lit up. Yeah. You know, if you look out. Oh yeah, we can do this at night too. Yep. Oh yeah. That's yeah. awesome. So I think this is holding up pretty well. I mean, mud guards are really doing their job. This barely has any dirt on it. It's just all probably underneath. Yeah. So fun. Scandy flick. <laughs> she just eats it all. She loves it. fun's at. <laughs>
Yeah, it's not bad. Not bad at all. So much fun. Oh man. <laughs> Stuff like that just brings a smile to your face that just can't leave. It sure does. Oh. <laughs> uh. yep. Crazy fun. You like that baking over there? I do, yeah. <laughs> it's a good time.
Oh yeah. Too much sand. And it is not rough in there, you know? No, not at all. I'm surprised by, uh, surprised he's not like hitting the bump stops or bottoming out at all. Like it's good, oh, good yeah, suspension. He's, he's It's tough because I want to watch, but I got to watch the camera too. <laughs> cool down. blue too yeah that's right i am just so impressed at how well the brz did today it was at home out here it got through some really deep mud it was a champ on the kind of dirt sand sections and on gravel with these new tires it was just amazing i couldn't believe it <laughs> so much fun it's like my dream realized finally it's a pig in mud yeah it's a pig in mud <laughs> <laughs> and this is kind of the car's one year anniversary too. Like oh, yeah. it's been about a year since I bought it. I bought it in March 2022. So and start your year update with a, a yeah. slide slide. I didn't really like I don't think it's worse for wear with dirt slung up on the side. Like I'm not concerned about damaging the paint on the dirt. And we went through some pretty rough gravel. The mud flaps pretty much do all the work. Yeah. And underbody's probably getting a little bit, you know, beat up, but that's okay. It's, it's crowned. It's got crown rust control. It's yeah. not gonna rust, it's not going anywhere. Oh. Just like drive down a dirt road. Mm-hmm. Fun day. Fun day.